Hi folks, I'm Mark Johnson and uh, I'm looking at a log cabin today down at the Jackson County Fairgrounds. Uh, it's owned by the uh, Jackson County Historical Society and uh, I don't know how this is going to turn out. It's uh, windier than uh, than all heck today and uh, cold as well. So, uh, anyway, I'm gonna, uh, Oh, anyway, this, we'll start at the front of the building here, which is actually the uh, in the best condition of, of all four sides. Um, it's got masonry chinking in it, and uh, some of it needs to be re replaced because it doesn't have any mesh or reinforcing in it to hold it where it belongs. The bottom log here has got some decay and it's been filled in with um, with the uh, masonry chinking uh, and some of the corners have been repaired with it also there's a corner that's completely gone and we should I usually replace those with, with epoxy and here we are this is the, the left side of the building I been some repairs done up there um, where a board has been put in over a, a band lot. There's, uh, there's a spot there where some squirrel got in, but actually the logs are solid. Um, so there's ticking repair in a lot of places is necessary because back there but it's too far out so it's actually drawing in moisture on top of it here's a real good example of what I'm talking about there you can see the wire mesh on that but it should be in oh. well, some of the corners have been replaced with with cement and uh, we should do that with epoxy. It works better. There's a number of logs here on this side that are uh, bad. I think we've uh, got a oak logs down on the bottom, but um, this, this, these here, I, I suspect that these are, are probably basswood logs. They would, uh, they would often use lighter wood as they went up because they were uh, easier to lift. So here's another example of the chinking that's that's pulled loose and it's letting water in. So a lot of that should be removed. Here's another one. Um, this log here is another basswood log here this one will be replaced and this one here will be replaced and uh, in some cases where it's just, it's just the surface uh, we can do what we call a refacing instead of Example of the uh, uh, failed chinking. It's it's not moving or anything, but when it was applied, it, it, the whole thing should have been further in uh, side the logs instead of to the outside. Like th this is a, this is actually ideal. This one here is uh, the way they should all be done. But uh, got several logs replaced. Noted each of those on the 
drawing that I did. There's a clutter that's been completely rotted off. I'm gonna have to replace those. And that brings us back to where we started. And I guess that's going to be, that's about the end of it. <clears throat> Some other things will be done. Treating it in the logs with uh, boron preservative. And boron rods will be placed <clears throat> in all the corners. And the corners will be sealed with the end grain seal. Well, anyway, that was a lot of fun. Uh, I can't believe it's turned so cold today, but I'll, um, I'll write up a report and uh, send it over um, to the Historical Society and we'll, we'll talk about it uh, uh, later. Thanks for watching, folks.